HD cab. Yeah, they'll put this in the in the middle. Apparently you don't get your, I haven't actually driven or anything, you don't get your coat cut, stuck on it or anything apparently. So, and also the windscreen wiper is at the bottom, which is also the same as my um, 270, but everything over here is completely changed. All the, um, the layout and everything. The joystick, it's got far more, far more on it. All the other controls up here. There's also a lot more storage area as well. Up here, down here, and underneath the seat. If I can work out how to operate. Look at another cool area in here. That falls down, and I've got another one. A storage area in here. I've actually got a a plug socket in there with 230 volts so there must be an inverter in it somewhere and then a USB and charger in there as well oh a locking you can actually lock the lock the doors of the cab with that and then it's got vents here the speakers up here behind you um, and everything other things are down here like the flash, you've got lights and all that down here, diff lock, four wheel drive, PTO controls. You can look at the radio controls here, the telephone. So yeah, it's a big improvement. I wasn't there, vastly improved this light up here. This looks a lot better than the previous one. Gareth, you're now going to my next YouTube oh, video. Oh, yeah. I'm Hello, getting everyone. You. I'm Gareth, Ernest Stone, salesman. Pleased to meet you all. Five small valves, which you can reassign in the cab. You can change what they do, but it also changes the colour we hit in the cab as well, which is a good, a good function. It's got these are the hydraulic down here, and you can have a hydraulic top link that hasn't got a hydraulic top link. On the mud guard, you've got the controls. You can have two, one and two for rev revving the engine. Then you've got this stop, which is actually a kill switch. The PTO. Then you can have one spool valve, which you can choose which one you want. That's all programmable in the cab. Then you obviously got the up and down on the single linkage. There's 66 decibels. I don't know if you can read it, but. This is one of the older HD ones.
very windy today. I don't know if this microphone's any better or not, but we'll see. This is the new one, the one with the bigger cab. up that line you'll find us straight it is a dead straight this is the same tractor as the one I was in a few moments ago not the same tractor the same uh, model but this is just one they've got on a seven flower plow yeah a seven flower plow they soon get dirty
and you guys know I'm not a, a case fan, but here is a case on a combination drill. That is a 240, which I think, if I remember right, is the same size as uh, my tractor, which is a 270. It's got a hydraulic top link. It's a fantastic thing for when you're doing this, as you've seen on my drill, if you watch my videos, that is saves so much time getting in and out of the tractor having that hydraulic top link on there you can just adjust it and it's got on the side it's actually got a little scale where you can see exactly where it is which my one hasn't got which probably be a worthwhile thing me fitting on it and it's got a rod which fixed to the top there which obviously moves down on them colors as it goes along inside the case someone's actually nicked the, the screen is missing <laughs> 